The goal of our research ultimately is to develop improved varieties of cowpea that will enable smallholder farmers to produce more food from the same effort. In the U.S., cowpeas are known as black-eyed peas. A lot of our focus is uh, targeted at countries in sub-Saharan Africa, where cowpea is critically important in the diet. We're currently working in five countries. If we release new varieties in those countries, they quite likely will have regional importance and impact in being produced in neighboring countries. The problem is cowpeas underproduce. Cowpea is susceptible to drought events. If we can address through breeding the sensitivity of cowpea, to those problems, then the cowpea plant's going to be happier and will produce a lot more grain. What we do as geneticists is we study the genome of cowpea. We're finding positions within that genome or on that genetic map where favorable forms of genes exist. We routinely put through three generations per year in this greenhouse. And by using markers to look at progeny, we can improve our success rate and approach the ideal genotype much faster than you could without using markers. Our research project forms a tremendous training opportunity. We work very closely with researchers and plant breeders in several African countries. We've tapped into a lot of the new ability to communicate worldwide. The University of California has a food initiative and the research program we have fits into that general theme. We can impact positively the lives of millions of people through improving the nutritional quality of their diet.